Hi, welcome to Headway 101. My name is Corey Freeman, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a Headway child theme in five minutes or less. Um, but let's aim for less because you're probably busy and have things to do, and I want a sandwich. <laughs> the first thing you need to do to create your child theme is go ahead and grab a text editor. You can use uh, the default text editor that comes with your computer, but I like to use Coda because it has syntax highlighting, which you'll see um, turns the text a different color depending on the code you're using. Um, this is for Mac. For PC, I recommend Notepad++. Uh, free for Mac would be uh, Text Wrangler, whatever text editor you feel comfortable with. But Open one up, and we're going to do our style.css file, which every WordPress theme needs to have. Uh, so we're going to do forward slash, asterisk, then we're going to type theme name, all in capital letters, colon, and then name your child theme. So I'm going to call this empty headway child theme, because uh, it's not going to have any sort of content in it. New line, uh, type template, all capital letters space and then headway and lowercase letters and then asterisk forward slash um, this is the simplest way to declare it as a child theme and you're going to save this file as style.css it must be named style.css okay if you want to be able to use um php we also need to create a file called functions.php This file does not need to have content in it, but if you want it to, you can do PHP, new space, and then end the PHP tag, or you could just leave it open. Make sure that you do, however, have a space or a return after this PHP line, because if you don't, it will break your website. Uh, but I'm going to save that. And then I've already got the screenshot made. The screenshot dimensions are 300 pixels wide by 225 pixels in height. Um, you need to name it screenshot, but it can be .png, .gif, .jpg, whatever kind of file uh, type you want it to be. Okay. And then finally, just for security, I'm going to do an images folder. Uh, for And then inside the images folder, we're going to make a blank index. Oops, we're going to save a blank index.html file. And hit save. Um, and this is just where you can keep all of your background images and icons and so forth. Technically speaking, you only need a style.css file, uh, but for really getting into it, I recommend having at least this structure. Okay, now that we've got our files made, Let's go ahead and compress these items, or zip these items, or archive these items, depending on what kind of operating system you have. Uh, and then you can just name it whatever you want. I'm going to call it emptychildtheme.zip. And you've got a WordPress theme ready to install. Uh, so let me go to demo.headway101.com. Uh, and if I log in, Go to Appearance, Themes. Install Themes. Upload. Browse. Grab your theme.zip file. Click Install Now and then click Activate. All right. Remember to leave Headway Base installed. Uh, but if we go to our front page, you'll see it's all pretty blank. To edit your child theme, you can go ahead and go to the editor. And you can type your CSS code in here. Or you can use your text editor again and upload your files via FTP using your favorite FTP program. Um, but that's basically how you create a child theme. 
if you want to view the CSS or PHP webinars that are available on headway101.com slash classes slash recordings, you'll also see kind of how to work with child themes more in depth. I'm Corey Freeman. Thanks for watching.